Hello and welcome to the news from Bahrain International. I'm Samar Ajawi. His Majesty King Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa met today King Mohammed VI of Morocco on the occasion of His Majesty's visit to the Kingdom of Morocco. During the meeting, both leaders reviewed the close and historical brotherly relations between the two kingdoms and ways of developing them in a manner that serves the aspirations of the two countries and their citizens. His Majesty the King underscored the deep-rooted bilateral relations that are based on solid pillars of fruitful cooperation on all levels. His Majesty also expressed appreciation to King Mohammed VI for his role in strengthening and consolidating the relations of the two countries, wishing Morocco and its people further progress and prosperity. His Majesty the King's Representative for Charity Works and Youth Affairs, National Security Advisor and Supreme Council for Youth and Sports Affairs Chairman, his Highness Sheikh Nasser bin Hamad Al Khalifa congratulated His Majesty King Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa, His Royal Highness the Prime Minister Prince Khalifa bin Salman Al Khalifa, and His Royal Highness the Crown Prince, Deputy Supreme Commander and First Deputy Prime Minister Prince Salman bin Hamad Al Khalifa on Bahrain's qualification for the 2021 World Men's Handball Championship for the fifth time in its history. His Highness Sheikh Nasser bin Hamad Al Khalifa paid tribute to His Majesty the King, hailing the royal care for the youth and sports sector which yielded honorable achievements for the Kingdom of Bahrain and external arenas. He also lauded the support of His Royal Highness the Prime Minister and His Royal Highness the Crown Prince. He also praised the role played by His Highness Sheikh Khalid bin Hamad Al Khalifa, first Deputy President of the Supreme Council for Youth and Sports and President of the Bahrain Olympic Committee. His Highness Sheikh Nasser lauded the outstanding performance of the national team in the Asian Handball Championship, which is held in Kuwait, hailing Bahrain's qualification to the semi-finals after beating Saudi Arabia 18-17. He also praised the efforts exerted by Bahrain Handball Association, chaired by Mr. Ali Isa Ishaqi, wishing the national team further success. The Rashid Club for Equestrian and Horse Racing organized today the 13th race of the season, which was held on the Lexus Cup, sponsored by Ibrahim Khalil Kano Company and the Fatis Al Hajri Cup, for Arabian Horses and the Royal Golf Club Cup on the race track in Rafa Sakhir. The race was in the presence of His Highness Sheikh Mohammed bin Rashid bin Isa Al Khalifa, His Highness Sheikh Sultan al Din bin Mohammed bin Salman Al Khalifa, His Highness Sheikh Khalid bin Ali bin Isa Al Khalifa, the President of the Royal Equestrian and Endurance Federation, His Highness Sheikh Isa bin Abdullah bin Isa Al Khalifa, His Highness Sheikh Abdullah bin Rashid bin Isa Al Khalifa, and His Highness Sheikh Nadir bin Mohammed bin Salman Al Khalifa, and well as an audience of horse racing fans. The winners of the race cups were then awarded were the general manager, relations and corporate standards of Ibrahim Khalil Kano, Ammar Boubshed, who presented the Lexus Cups for the second and fifth round to the winners, Hamad Saeed, and the Lexus Cup for the eighth round to the winner, Jafar Marzouk. The director of sales at the Ibrahim Khalil Kano company, Ala Abdelman, and presented the Lexus Cup of the first round to the winner James Naylor and the Lexus Cup for the seventh round to the winning owner Ibrahim Al Afu while Rashid Al Hajri presented the cup of Fatis bin Salim Al Hajri to the rider Yusuf Tahir and the general director of the Royal Valley Golf Club Christopher awarded the club's cup to the rider Abdullah Kwaiti.
Bahrain's handball team qualified for the 2021 World Men's Handball Championship after they beat Saudi Arabia 18-17 in a tightly fought match in Kuwait. Bahrain led 106 at halftime. The win allowed Bahrain to qualify for the semifinals of the Asian Cup alongside Japan from Group 1. The semifinals will be played tomorrow. Under the new rules, the four teams that qualify for the penultimate matches for the Asian Trophy automatically book their tickets to the 2021 World Men's Handball Championship to be held in January next year in Egypt. Bahrain had qualified for the World Cup Finals in 2011 in Sweden, 2015 in France, 2019 in Denmark and Germany.